What? Doggy boy, calm down. He knows. The old guy kept him around for a reason. It's cause he can really help out in a pinch. Wish I could move like you, Wolfie. Stuck on this side. Okay. Alright. There goes nothing. Whoa! Awesome. Oh, that's not good for escaping. If we ever need to come back this way. Eh, not bad for a guy missing a few fingers. See that? I do got moves. Don't I, Wolfie? Ooh. I can't tell if these are the mines already. Or we're, are we still in the sanatorium? Or is it more like a connecting part between the two? Detention area. Oh my god. What does that say? Oh, it's a chain! I thought it was words. Words on the wall. What's rotting over there? Oh my god. That's... Huh. Reporting physician, Dr. W.B. Cathcart. Initial report. The patients were first admitted to Blackwood's medical facility five days ago. During this time, we have run a number of tests, both physiological and psychological. The results have been extraordinary, in contravention of common medical expectations. Symptoms observed. Pallor. Skin dispigmentation. Oh, becoming white. Severe vitamin D deficiency. Social dysfunction. Longer than average readaptation period, post-traumatic event, interpersonal behavior erratic, violence towards orderlies, three attempted assaults, one attempted scratching. Symptoms expected but not observed, malnutrition, scurvy. Average cutelet index was only within 3% of normal expected values. They should be dead. They are dead, in a way. Frostbite. Patient stimulus response within acceptable bounds. Frailty, weakness, detention, distension of tibia, fibia, and humerus. Those are bones. Average one inch, plus one inch. Observed unusual growth in strength. One patient lifted 725 pounds weight. That must be Olympic category already. Suggested action. Place under strict observation. Restraint strongly recommended. Change from one orderly to three orderlies. So they slowly change. It's not right away. I feel like if you had symptoms like this, you should really be transporting them to some other more advanced medical facility off the mountain already. But I guess it's a good thing they didn't because... Oh my god, could you imagine if they all got off the mountain? I don't know if they're bound to the mountain or anything like that. Because the Wendigo spirit, uh, earlier when we read Ashley's book, The Stranger's Book, it mentioned something about how... Oh my god. Is that the other wolf? How the spirit was released from the mountain. Oh, son of a bitch. <laughs> Jesus Christ. What the fuck have I got myself into? Man, these things just kill anything they can get their hands on. Human or wolf. Huh. These doors were built like tanks. How crazy were these inmates? Let us out. What went on here? We are starving. This is nuts. Freezing. 
I will make you pay. Stop testing us now. They've been here for nine days. Eventually, they just broke down the door. Holy crap. What? What was that? What the frick? Ah, oh, so much for no Wendigos here. What does that say? I can't see the wall. Wolfie, where are you? I should really pay attention to him barking or acting weird. He can probably tell where they are. Faster and more often than I can. B-Wing. Doctor's office? Nope. I guess we're going this way. I don't know which way we're going, actually. <laughs> oh! Nope. Oh no, he's barking! That's not good! Okay. Wow, how far does this go? There's so many rooms here, I don't even want to look at. Like sometimes when you guys tell me, hey, can you look around more thoroughly? I'm like, I don't really want to look around. <laughs> Blackwood Sanatorium. Confidential. Patient number nine. Progression of skeletal... Hyperostosis. I don't know what that is. Day 4. Epidermal dispigmentation. Expected after time underground. Severe curvature of thoracic region. Post-traumatic kyphosis, corneal dystrophy, and clouding. Acuity is low. Yeah, that's the eyes becoming milky white. Whoa! Look at that picture. He's kind of a handsome fellow, and then now this. Five days later. Chronic kyphosis. Scarring alopecia. Extreme nasal septum perforation. Ectodermal dysplasia. Pointing of teeth. Jesus, hot sauce, Christmas cake. This is fucking unbelievable. <laughs> All these medical words. Day 12, telogen effluvium, not alopecia. Maxillary canine length, the teeth, the teeth are getting long and sharp. Consistent with corneal oedemia, but acuity now 2022, which is very good. Epidermal toughening, stratum corneum. Okay, so in the beginning, they seemed like, you know, they seem pretty normal for someone who's just been rescued out of the mines. Kind of tired and discolored because they haven't seen sunlight for a while now and then here they've begun to become really really weird starting to look less and less human and the nose something is wrong with the septum as well and the teeth are growing and now finally it's like a vampire a zombie and the vision the vision got better despite the eyes being clouded Oh, what the hell is this shit? No. No! Um... I know he's been in there for like 50 years or whatever, but... Okay, can we look around the room first? I don't really want to deal with that. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, there's nothing here. Is it a secret compartment here? What is that? Oh, Jesus, 
Jesus. Jesus. Are we sure about this? That's one more bullet. Oh. I totally know you're here. Wolfie's not here. Holy shit. Who is this guy? Okay, let's get this over with. Sorry, I'll do it. What? Oh. I had to hold on to it, okay. To whom it may concern. And then when I flip it, my, his face is gonna be right there. They are dying outside. I hear them screaming and crying. This hell is my only legacy. God's punishment for my mistakes. No escaping my fate. Death awaits me now. Jefferson Bragg. That's the owner of the sanatorium. Mr. Bragg. Oh dear. He locked himself in here. I don't think he turned because his face, the skeletal features, still seemed like a person, but oh dear. He starved to death in here then. Or maybe he drank the poison, yeah. Right there. Oh my goodness. No one ever found him. Because he was hidden behind the wall. Okay. I know there's another room over here. It's not the room we came from. Ooh, a film. Great. Ah, uh, there's a person and a nurse. Person in a chair, probably a minor. It's a time lapse. Whoa. Whoa. That's a. Uh... Whoa. Oh my god. Oh my god. What the fuck is going on around here? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Well, nothing we didn't already know, but seeing it get someone, that's... That's just disturbing. That was in 24-7 supervision. They said they were gonna do that, but all they did was left the camera there. The nurse walked away. That was in 24-7. Not that 24-7 would have helped things, but you know. Ewing. Fuck! Hey, if we stand still, but the torch, the flame on the torch is moving, will the Wendigo sense us? What's up, buddy? Waiting for me? Okay. Not that stupid. Fucking rat. Whoa! Huh? Huh? How's that for you, fuck? Oh my god. Okay, QTE mode, QTE mode. Go left, go left. There's a way out. You didn't run nearly far enough. God damn it. The window! What are you doing, dude? No! No! 
Not on point today. Not this again. Lost my machete. Talking way too much for someone who's scared. Where are you? Huh? Damn it. What the? What? What? Behind you. It's fine, it's inside, it's inside, it's fine. Mike, you need to just freaking get away. These are the ones that the. Yep. Totem. One at a time, boys. It's enough for me for all ya! No, it's fine, it's fine. Huh? Okay. These are the ones that the old guy trapped inside. The sanatorium, the six Wendigo. Fuck, that got me almost. Whoa! Yeah, this one we need to shoot. Dude, just run! Just forget it. Thanks for the help, wolf buddy. Oh, there's the free one! Oh. So on edge. There's two. Yup, 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 yup. Shoot it, shoot it. Oh crap. Oh, oh no, it died. Where's the wolf? Where's the wolf? Where's the wolf? Oh my god. Mike, don't tell me you killed the wolf. Oh no, that's horrible. We gotta go though. Oh no, this is really bad. Because we killed one of the Wendigo. It might possess someone else now. And when I say might, I'm pretty sure it will. So let's get out of here before it possesses us. Oh my god. Hey, it shouldn't possess me though, right? Because I'm not hungry right now. And I'm not about to eat anyone just yet. Oh, Mike. You need a plan. You're very brave, but you have no plan. You never have a plan.
I'm kind of in like, get the fuck out of here mode right now. I don't want to explore. <laughs> Fuck. Can we go in here? No. Shut oh my god, escape, escape. Please not into the mines. Oh my god, I'm done hey, with buddy. the mines. Hey! Come on down. Sorry. Right. Oh. oh no! What the fuck? No! No! <laughs> I'm so sad. Okay, he gave up his life for me. I gotta live for him. Whoa! Oh no! Ah! No! There were so many different ones. I didn't know which one was a red barrel or not. Jess! What the fuck? Come on, guys, hurry up. We gotta find Mike. Come on. Hey, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of giving out here, guys. Uh, I think maybe you should go on without me. Yeah, we're not leaving him. Okay, the way they phrase that, inquire and reassure. You're gonna be okay. You're gonna be okay. You're gonna be okay means we're gonna leave you, doesn't it? No, we're not leaving. We're a group! We're a group! You're gonna die without us, okay? No, Chris, we are not leaving you. We're sticking together. Mike will just have to wait. Yes! Oh, we can go now. Like, if we left Chris, we would have two people away in our group. What the hell are we- Oh my god. Ash, where are you going? By yourself. <laughs> I don't like this at all. There's <laughs> goddamn nothing here. <laughs> Not even a totem for my troubles. Guys, don't leave me. Guys? Come on. Where the hell is everyone? Oh, okay. They walked so far ahead without me. Oh! Red. Whoa. Whoa. What? Josh. Josh is gonna turn into a Wendigo? When it says danger, does it mean danger, Josh might turn into a Wendigo? Or does it mean danger, guys? Josh might attack you. Not sure of their intentions there. No! Mike made a friend. The wolf guided Mike around the sanatorium. Mike failed to protect his new friend. No, I'm so sad. I'm 
so sad. What could I have done to save the wolf? If I barricaded the door? Is that it? Oh, I'm so sad. Ashley was faced with a dilemma and told the truth. That wasn't really a dilemma. It was it was the right thing to do. If Ashley didn't say it, that would have been like the biggest asshole move in the entire game. Ashley wouldn't leave Chris. Oh, we're getting very close to the end. Just a few more butterflies. Guys, please wait for me. You want to go we, down? Should, should we try it? Well, it's not like we got a whole lot of choices here. Okay, if you say so. <clears throat> okay, this is maybe the last place I would want to be right now. So who's going first? <laughs> Not me. Thank you, Sam. It's not so bad. She falls you think down. This is the tunnel to the sanatorium? Of course it is. Where else would it go? How do you know that? You don't. You're just making some crazy assumptions. Chris. <laughs> I know you're hurt, but you gotta move it, all right? I'm trying, Ash. Mm. He's not that hurt, is he? <sighs> uh, as far as I know, <sighs> I actually don't recall him having any injuries. <sighs> hey, um... Hey, we should close this, right? Huh? I mean, what if something's following us? Yes, fine, close it. But we gotta keep moving. Can you just catch up, please? What? Yeah. Oh, I'm actually glad they didn't make me choose here, because I wouldn't have known what to choose. Close it or not close it. <sighs> you guys are some friends. Thanks for watching out for me. <laughs> Okay, let's catch up. Oh, what the hell? This looks like it goes to the mines. Guys, how far could you have walked? That was 10 seconds, tops. there? Anybody? Jessica! Is it you? That's... Remember the thing about mimicry? Okay, I hear whispering right now. I think that's just to distract me, but... It's kind of curious to me that while it did sound like Jessica, I couldn't make out a single English word it said. Yeah... Mimicry? Oh, but if it is Jessica... We're gonna be leaving her. But I might be putting Ash into danger. Oh... Hmm... Okay, if it was Jessica, why would not she just continue to, to yell? Help me, help me, help me! Why does she yell once or twice? Why did Sam, Chris, and Em not hear this? I think it knows I'm isolated. Oh no, I'm not doing this. Hello? No, I think this is a bad idea. Especially after we found out about the whole mimicry thing. Oh, gosh! 
I could have left Jessica just now, though. Oh. Oh my god, I am so glad to see you. Glad you're safe. Yeah, thanks for waiting for me, guys. Look. Look there. Wow, great. <gasps> the ladder's toast. We're never gonna make it up there. No, 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 I think I can. I think I can do it. It's like a rock wall. I'm gonna keep going. No. <laughs> I've gotta get Mike. Good luck. What? That wasn't even up for discussion. She just kind of did it. Hey, good luck, Sam. <laughs> Oh, the water wheel! Fortune! Sam does not have a weapon. Oh! Well, we know that Josh should be okay for now. I'm gonna test how my QTE skills are today. Okay, I'm doing good. Okay, don't get cocky though. Fuck! Never mind. Ugh. Let's play it safe today then. Jump? Yeah, Jump? That's right. uh, I beat you. I fucking beat you. Not my greatest condition today, but okay. I just really need to focus. Hey, I like your I like the head flashlight. Drop down. <sighs> I can't believe Sam just separated on her own after like we were just saying, no, Chris, we can't leave you. We gotta be we gotta stick together now. Huh. Really? Okay. What about this? If Sam runs into anything, we're done. What the fuck? Jesus. Oh no. We're stuck here. We can't drop down. The only way is to go forward. There are too many ways I can- ugh, I can't explore here. Everything's breaking apart. What the fuck? Huh. Good call. Did we end up at the same place anyway? The same place as the other drop down point? Oh shit. You don't need to put that down. Outside. That's not the sanatorium. Uh, earlier, the stranger okay. thing. Which way? 
Oh, that's... I'm not sure. Because over here, we can see the sanatorium right there. If I go over here, I'm not too sure about that. Earlier, the diary mentioned something about buildings. It can't go into buildings or something? So I don't feel too good about being outside. Okay, we're going the longer way. Right. Right is the right way. Don't fail me, symbolism. Uh-oh. Well, we got here anyway. That seems good. Is this the back side of the sanatorium? I don't recognize this. Holy shit! Shit! I'm getting better. Ooh, shit. How many people would run toward the source of the sound? Oh my god. It's inside. You're outside. You don't need to go inside. Mike! Oh! Woo! Shoot, Mike! That's it. That's it. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Oh, you're one lucky son of a bitch, Mike. Sitting right on top of a barrel. Oh no, another spirit. Any marshmallows? We're so fucked. Even if we make it out of here, the mountain is so screwed. Cause the old guy is dead. Who's gonna keep the spirits in check? Let's find a way down to where this fucker lives. 